Monster Hunter Worlds has had a lot of issues with performance. So much that people are desperate to find ways to make their game look a bit better and also run a bit better at the same time. I mean, I made my own video about the one specific way of doing it. And even though it doesn't work for everyone, at least it gets some people the chance of getting a bit better FPS. That being said, there seems to be a new, very weird fix where apparently if you change one little line of code in your configuration of the game, it apparently fixes your FPS. But is this actually true? It sounds like complete copium. I mean, how is it going to be one line, one typo in the code that you can change and everything's fixed? Well, let's see if it's true. Subscribe to the channel for more content like this. And let's see if this works. Now, according to this, what you have to do is go into this very specific uh, notepad in the folder of um, Monster Hunter Wilds. And you can see here that it says minimum streaming texture resolution equals minimum streaming texture resolution. So there's a typo there. Instead of saying resolution, it says resolution. And according to people, if you actually type resolution in there, you know, to fix the typo, DR FPS will go up. And of course, essentially the idea is that, hey, they fucked up one of the lines and the game would run better if they didn't do that, right? So by changing this one thing, you're essentially making it so the game works correctly instead of this weird typo that makes everything just not work correctly. You can see this post having 2K upvotes. According to, you know, people are essentially saying that it indeed does work. Some people are saying that it went from 100 to 20 FPS to 140, and there's different types of, uh, you know, other comments saying the same thing. Now, there's also some people saying that it didn't do anything for them, so it seems to be like a little bit of a, uh, you know, 50-50 or something like that, out of the fact that it actually does work or not. But, it actually might be placebo. Uh, as you can see here in um, the other, in one of the common threads, it says, it's a placebo, see the following. And, and I went in there, I, I want to check what this uh, things, what this posts were. And it says, likely a placebo, the executable ha also has a typo. So it actually refers to a node named that way in the configuration. It's not an error. And if you click that, you can see that the end in the execution, in the executable of Monster Hunter Wilds.exe, it says minimum streaming texture resolution as well. So it actually is indeed tied to the specific part of the configuration as well, even after you change it. Even when it says resolution, the executable knows that it says resolution, and of course, it binds itself to whatever you say here. So whenever you actually change the typo, it actually goes, it actually stops using this configuration in the notepad. So technically, all the people that are saying that this is working for them is by them not really fixing the issue and actually making so the configuration actually works but instead of making it so it doesn't work now it could be best possible somehow that for some reason that gives you better fps it sounds insane um so we're gonna go through it and check it anyways uh but yeah there there you go so right now on my computer while recording i'm around 40 30 40 FPS, 38 FPS, more or less. You can see it on the top right. It's a bit small. Uh, I'll, I'll do a little bit of a zoom in for you guys. Uh, but that's the situation we're at. That's the FPS that I have. I'm just running around here. I'm sure whenever I'm actually finding a monster, things will change a little bit. I just want to have a little bit of a small space with no with no changes so I can actually tell whether the, whether the, whether the notepad changes anything. So around in this very specific spot, I'm around between 35 FPS and 45 or something like that, right? Now, this is because of the fact that I actually went in here and uncapped my frame rate. Usually, I have it capped 30 FPS, and then I go in here and enable frame generation so I can get perfectly to 60 most of the time. It ends up working very, very well for me. It's the only way that I can actually stream and record uh, and uh, record this game. Uh, and, well, for some other people, if you want to make the game look a bit better while doing this, I have a video on it with lossless scaling. Yes, technically, it isn't 60 FPS. It's... You know, you're just kind of doubling your FPS to make it look a bit better for you. But at the end of the day, I don't really care. I just want the game to feel smooth. But, you know, I know some people disagree with that, which is completely fine. But for this experiment, we're just going to disable this, of course. Uh, and we're going to have uncapped frame rate so we can check more or less, at least on my setup, uh, if it does anything or not. Of course, the the mileage might vary for you. So definitely go check it out yourself. Change the notepad yourself and see if it does anything for you. Now go in here. We're going to quit the game and we're going to change the notepad, shall we? We're gonna go here to Steam Library, Steam Apps, Common, and then we're gonna go here to Monster Hunter Wilds, not the beta test, but the normal version. Then we're gonna go here into Config, gonna open with 
notepad you're gonna see the entire thing right here we're gonna search for the resolution well resolution i guess and there we go we found it after a little bit you can see that it says resolution instead of resolution we're gonna go here we're gonna change this to re so lucian there we go 256 just like the number before we're gonna save it boom and then very important step of this you're gonna have to go into properties and then enable raid only this is the only way that this actually ends up working and the change actually happens you're gonna say okay and gonna relaunch the game and see if there's any difference with the fps we had on that very specific spot same spot as before and the FPS seems pretty similar. We're between 45 right now, just idle. And while I'm moving around, it's actually lagging a little bit. I I'm not sure it's just because I launched the game again, but like the game is kind of struggling there. Okay, it's okay. I think we're good now. Maybe it was just loading some stuff. Uh, but there you go. I mean, it's 40. It seems to be very, 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 very similar. Uh, maybe it's a little bit more consistent. It's staying on the 40s instead of going to like 38, 35. But the difference is, is just not that big um it doesn't seem like it's changing anything and of course the faster i move maybe it's a little bit more consistent i it's it's very hard to tell the, the, the difference seems to be very very small uh, of course there might actually be some other situations where it's actually better maybe it's more consistent in terms of um whenever you're actually fighting monsters for some reason um I just I don't know I don't quite see the, the I I don't I don't think it's real guys I think it might actually be just placebo. Uh, that being said, guys, go try it yourself. It doesn't really take a while to do like it's just and also look honestly even if it is placebo, if it makes you feel better, did awesome. Did like <laughs> you know what I mean like if you're ha if you're not happy with the FPS and then you change this and it makes you feel better for having better uh, worse FPS and it makes and you think like it actually did it work. Dude, who cares if it's not real, dude? It is making you happy. Fuck it. Okay, like at the end of the day, the only time that the only way that this gets fixed is by the developers actually going through and fixing the optimization issues with this game. Uh so whatever, right? Like just I'm also kind of curious on whether this indeed changed back or not. I'm just gonna go here and just check. Sometimes you launch the game, um, and the game is like, no, actually, uh you should actually this is not the way that it should be typed. And it just changes it back. But in this case, no, it doesn't seem like it. I'm going to go back and post it again as we had before. Uh, just because I don't really think it changes anything. Or it's going to it's gonna change it back to the original. Until someone actually can indeed give us more information about this exact problem. And why is it happening. And whether it indeed does work or not. I'm sure it's just a matter of time until one of the, you know. Someone goes into the code and exactly... Uh, explains why this works or why it doesn't work so until then uh, and i'm sure guys i will indeed uh cover that whenever it happens uh until then i think it's you know go check it out see if it works if it doesn't boom it doesn't work and if it does nice happy uh so there you go I hope this was a little bit uh, interesting for you, a little bit educative, ed educative, educative. Uh, and uh, regardless, I hope you enjoyed the video. So subscribe to the channel for more content like this, and uh, see you around. Love you.